Hey y'all, good morning. This is Victoria B. Welcome to my channel. I'm back. Um, this morning I have a channeled message that I need to deliver to you guys immediately. Um, the videos that I've been doing on a karmic masculine is trying to kill you. Um, I got a message from Spirit that this person is going to pass away soon. Okay. Um, it's either going to be by dementia because this person's older or it's going to be a car accident something like that and i kept i kept seeing the mile marker 220 mile marker 220 on a highway if it's going to be it's either a car accident and this person right now is getting dementia they're getting older um not trying to be mean this is just a message that i channeled okay and let's see what spirit has to say about this just a message. I'm just a I'm just a delivery person. Don't shoot the messenger. Okay, who are we reading for? Holy Spirit, holy angels, ancestors of the highest white light. Allow me to be the channel for this person that I have been channeling for a while, this karmic masculine. Is trying to harm someone and I got a message that they're going to be passing away soon either they're getting they have dementia now and they could be out driving something could happen to them I mean I hope not but this is what this is what I'm channeling mile, mile marker 220 so I'm getting on okay thank you spirit the king of Pentacles this is Taurus Capricorn Virgo energy it could be a, a husband and someone that's financially stable. Okay. Okay, and that's our male karmic. Okay, let's get this is karmic. This is the uh, masculine karmic and the divine feminine. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors of the Highest White Light. Allow me to be the channel. Let me know what I need to know. Who is this Divine Feminine that we are reading for? Thank you, Spirit. The Queen of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. That's our Divine Feminine. Okay. On the bottom, we have the King of Cups. Okay. So our masculine is the king of pentacles and our feminine, our divine feminine is the queen of swords. Okay, this is this is a karmic and the divine feminine reading. Okay. All right, Holy Spirit, holy angels, ancestors of the highest white light. Please let me know what is the energy of this king of pentacles that I got the message about, the one that has been they were in the they were in the King of Swords energy. Now they're in the King of Pentacles. This person is an older person, an older man. They could be having dementia right now. Um, I got a message. Like I said, they're going to pass away soon. It's most likely, I'm thinking, a car accident. Okay, this is a warning for somebody out there. Mile marker 220. That's what I'm getting on a highway. Okay, what is the inner what is what do we need to know about this King of Pentacles? It's gonna pass away soon. King of Pentacles, it's gonna pass away soon. They were in the King of Swords energy earlier, now they're in the King of Pentacles. Okay. Okay, we have the Ace of Pentacles, the Ace of Coins. Um, this person is financially stable. All right, and then we have the two of coins. Um, they could be, like I said, I'm getting this person has dementia right now, and they could be a little, a little bit senile. They just they don't have a, a serious case of dementia yet, but they're forgetting things, they're not remembering things, and they're kind of going back and forth in their mind. They're not able to really see things clearly. Um, they are, how do I say this? 
they are they can only remember long-term memories they're having trouble remembering short-term memories they're going back and forth between the past they're getting messages that this person has hurt a lot of people okay this is the one i told you that they've been married like five times they're financially stable but they have hurt a lot of people they may be going they may be having memories about this memories about all the people they have hurt in the past and they're going back and forth in their head they're juggling and they have dementia they're not seeing things real clear right now and we have justice this is libra energy okay what i'm getting for this is this um feminine energy this queen of swords the divine feminine is going to get some justice in this situation because this person has been harassing this queen of swords divine feminine for a lot of years okay there's going to be some kind of justice coming in and like i said with the justice card um this in the previous videos this this was the king of swords energy they could be they could have been in like a law enforcement situation a law enforcement field of work something like that and then we have the three of pentacles three of pentacles They could have had like three other people going against you, going against this Divine Feminine Queen of Swords. The moon is secrets and Major Arcana. The moon is secrets. Um, it's not revealed yet, but some secrets are going to come out about this King of Pentacles energy here. The one that was been trying to harm this Queen of Swords over here. It's been going on a lot of years. On the bottom of the deck, we have the Ten of Pentacles. So like I said, this person here, this king of pentacles is probably right now married to someone else, okay? But they did not, they have never forgot about this queen of swords. This queen of swords, you could have cut them off, but they never forgot about you, okay? They love you and they hate you at the same time. They have not forgot about you. This person's married. They have money, but their health is going bad. Wow. Hmm. Okay. What else? Let me see. What is the justice card? What is this, please? What is the justice card? Okay, the five of pentacles. Okay, um, the five of pentacles in death. Okay, this is the justice coming in um, for the queen of swords, which is our divine feminine. And again, this is our karmic masculine. All right. The one that's been trying to hurt you for years. The Five of Pentacles. All right. What's going to come in? What's going to happen in death? Okay. And in this case, it's going to be an actual death because this is a channeled message. Okay. I know death does not mean that all the time, but in this case, it does. All right. Justice. This Queen of Swords is going to get some justice now, this Divine Feminine. This person is going to... Event, they're gonna they're gonna go into poverty. That's the justice. That's what's gonna happen, and they're having a lot of health issues. I'm getting a message. They are gonna die. They are gonna die. They're gonna pass away. I don't know when. A lot of my reach. A lot of my readings are for f the future, so it could be sometime in the future they are gonna pass away. In this case, it does mean an actual death. Okay. Mm mm mm. We have the King of Wands on the bottom. This person um, could be an earth sign or a fire sign. Okay. Wow. And also I have the King of Swords. There he is again. But this person was in King of Swords energy. We have, we have the King of Pentacles, the King of Wands. And the, the King of Pentacles, the King of Wands, and this King of Swords. So this person is very dominating with three kings this person is a very dominating person they're very controlling okay they've been married about five times and on the four of cups um they're in despair they're not happy right now and this person doesn't look pretty stressed out on this card cancer energy it could be a cancer you're dealing with cancer also this person is in regret they feel like they missed an opportunity with you because they see you now they see you now this person has never forgot about you they've never gotten over you okay mm. oh 
All right. Let me pause the video for a second. Excuse me. Okay. What I'm trying to say is I ask about what type of sickness they have. They have dementia. They also could have gout with the king of pentacles. And with the two of pentacles, two of pentacles, they could have something like um, prostate cancer, something like that also. That's another message that I'm getting. Okay? So this is just this is a channeled message. It is going to be a death. I don't know when it's going to be, when it's going to happen. But let's see what we have the energy for the Divine Feminine, the Queen of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. What is the energy of our Divine Feminine, please? Divine Feminine. Oh, wow, we have the devil. Okay. <laughs> okay, the divine feminine could be a Capricorn. Okay. Wow. The devil and the ten of cups. Wow. That's that's odd. The ten of cups. Okay. Ten of cups and the devil. Okay, let's see. Why is the devil card here for this divine feminine? For the queen of swords? Why is this devil card here? Why is the devil card here? Thank you, spirit. Okay, we have the king of wands. Again, the king of wands. There's a couple of those in this deck. King of wands. And the hermit. The hermit. Okay. <laughs> okay. This could be, since it is a divine feminine, this could be a Capricorn or somebody with Capricorn in their chart. But what I'm seeing is this divine feminine, the court card we got, the Queen of Swords and the King of Wands, this divine feminine could be an entrepreneur. What has happened is this Ten of Cups here. This divine feminine could be a very happy, be very a very happy person. They could have the Ten of Cups relationship, but they have discovered something about this King of Pentacles, King of Wands, King of Swords energy. They've had a premonition. Okay, they've had a premonition. They know this person is going to pass away soon. Okay, and also with the three. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm not going to take that card. They know, they intuitively know this person. What I'm getting with this, since this is a divine feminine, what they could have found out about this King of Pentacles, King of Swords energy over here. They got a message that this person has been, was very, they were in a very toxic relationship with this King, this, uh, per, this, this karmic masculine over here. Okay. This person's happy. This divine feminine is could be a psychic, could be could have foresight, but they have discovered, they have shown the light on this person. This king of this person over here is actually the one that's the devil. Okay? Wow. Then we have the star on the bottom. This is an Aquarius. This Queen of Swords could be an Aquarius, divine feminine. Or you could just be a star. Take it how it resonates. Hmm, this is a weird reading. Like I said, they could have, right now, they could have dementia. That's the channel messages I got. They could have gout, or they could have some kind of um, prostate cancer, something to do with the testicles, something like that. This is a man I'm talking about. And this Queen of Swords is a woman. Okay. Let's see. Let's verify the moon. What is the moon spirit for this king of pinnacles, king of swords energy, please? What is the moon? What is the moon, please? Okay, queen of wands. Okay, this king of pinnacles, king
king of swords energy or karmic male could be with a queen of wands or it could be they know a secret about this queen of wands this could be the divine feminine's energy or it could be their energy they could have a queen of wands as a part that could be their partner there could be something they could have like hired a witch to do spell work on you sometimes the queen of wands is a witch wow oh yeah four of pentacles okay this is somebody hold this king of king of pentacles king of swords energy is holding on to this queen of swords okay four of pentacles they're holding on to them still after all these years but feel separated from them so this divine feminine could actually be it's a secret they're secretly still that's what it is they're secretly still in love with this queen of wands which is this is divine feminine over here it could be either a fire sign or an air sign okay they're still in love with them that's what i'm getting out of that okay and they're still holding on to you with their heart chakra but feeling separated from you wow five of cups now that they now that they're sick now that they're having problems they're having health issues and I'm also getting they may have a car accident. You know, I'm hoping that this gets right to the right person. But be careful for mile marker 220. I don't know what that is. Five of Cups. This person could be, this our karmic male could be in deep regret about what they've done to this feminine over here. This feminine is the Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords energy. Okay, it could be a fire sign or an air sign. And then we have our King of Pentacles again. Okay, verified. Wow, okay. Hmm. four wands okay this person this king of pentacles has a house they could be in the house alone this uh, fairy here is very sad they're in a four wands they're in a some kind of relationship situation or a house this person could be alone now all right they could have something could have happened they may be alone now and they're not see this fairy here they're just kind of laying there they're not feeling well they're sick wow justice again twice this person's mad our karmic male is very mad they feel like they are owed some justice in this situation mm -mm -mm. we have the page of pentacles they may want to come and talk to you and tell you that they're sorry with that five of cups for all the things they've done to you over the years. The three of wands indicates they could live at a distance from this divine feminine, whoever I'm talking to. And the ace of swords verifies that this reading is the truth. Okay, so the main thing that I got is death. Let's see, what is this death card? Let's just pull it up. Like I said, this is going. it could be an actual death in this case. It does. It can mean that. So, it's the channel message that I got. Something about mile marker two twenty. Just to repeat that and make sure you heard that. The karma for this person for doing this to, do, to this divine feminist queen of wands. Our divine feminist, the queen of wands, and the queen of swords energy. What their karma will be? They're sick now. They have dementia. They could have prostate cancer, something like that. They're secretly still in love with this feminine, but this person would never tell you that they would never tell you that. Okay, they're going to go into poverty with the Five of Pentacles, the Justice card, the Five of Pentacles, and the Four of Cups. They're dissatisfied. They're going to go into poverty. That's the Justice card, and death came up. So, what? Let's see. What? Give us some more information on this death card for this karmic male, the King of Pentacles and the King of Swords energy. What is the death card, please? Mm -hmm. Yep, seven of pentacles can mean, you know, it's maybe their time to go in divine timing. I don't know when this, I don't know if this is for the future or now. Usually my readings, a lot of them, channel messages are for future reference. Ace of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Yeah, with a death card, they didn't realize you were a gift to them, Divine Feminine. 
and the Six of Cups. This could have happened in a past life as well. Okay. Yep. Let's ask the cards. Is this person, this King of Pentacles, King of Swords, are they going to pass away? Is this car accident going to take them out? Is this car accident going to take them out? Yes or no? Yes or no? Page of Cups. Yes. That's a yes card. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, that's a yes card also. Um... Six of Pentacles, yep. Mm hmm On the bottom. Okay. But that's all I have. This wasn't the most pos positive message, but I did channel that, okay? This person, this is the same person that was on, on all my readings about divine feminine a karmic male is trying to kill you there's like three or four there's like three of them and this is going to be the end of it this person is going to they're, they're going to die they're going to get um they're eventually they're going to pass away soon they're already like i said they have dementia and they have something going on with they had, could possibly have prostate cancer with that two of pentacles something to do with their testicles it is a man and it that could that is, it could be a prostate issue as well. And they are in regret what they did. But the whole reading is, it's the truth with the Ace of Swords. And like I said, um, that's all I have. That's all I have. It's, I don't know when it's going to happen. It could happen soon or in the distant future. Okay. All right. So... Whoever this is I'm talking to, this Divine Feminine, this um, Queen of Swords, Queen of Wands energy. Um, when this person passes away, and I'm not trying to be mean, okay? This is just a message that I got from Spirit. You will have the peace that you need. This person has been harassing you for years, messing with you for years, and you will finally get peace. The Justice card. Justice came out twice. Right now, this person... Had the Ten of Pentacles, their their karma is also good. They're 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 gonna have they're gonna be in poverty as well. Okay, that's your justice, and sometimes that's just the way life works out, because you reap what you sow. Okay, anyway, that's all I have, guys. I'll see you in my next reading. Have a good day.